We as teachers, we strongly believe of carrying out hands-on activities in class because it somehow motivates the students and not only that, it's much easier for the students to come up with the desirable learning activity when they carry out um, hands-on activities and practicals. Form 2 level, we divide the Form 2 students, which is about 100 plus. We divided them and then we have these uh, four stations, uh, one for testing for um, glucose, one for um, testing for um, protein and testing for fats. Normally, we have one teacher for 25 to 30 students, so this time we have one teacher to 8 students. Four teachers at one time in the class really helped us to share our ideas and help one another. Also, it helps to develop our strategies because we learn from one another. Normally, we do not allow the form to students to enter the lab or even do practical works because we are afraid of them um, breaking the classways, breaking the equipment, because we do not know where can we get the fun to provide more equipment. But running this project here at school in the Form 2 level, it really put us to uproot that barrier and allow the students to actually do the practical work. I, I always am asking myself what would have happened if they are exposed at this age, at Form 2. Because teaching in Form 6 and 7, it's just like the a beginning, because in Form 5, that's when they sit the national exams. We have put more effort in, into the study because of the exam result at the end of the year. With our media exam, we include this health and well-being. And we can see the difference. You know, when they see this changing of the color, of the solutions, and they were really excited. They gained better marks, in that particular topic than the rest of the dogs.